Hello, this is Chiron Intuition, and I'm here to do a reading for the collective. It's not going to resonate with everyone, but if it does, take what goes, and please leave what does not. We have the Seven of Pentacles energy here. Let me get something with the Seven of Pentacles. Okay, somebody invested a lot of time. We got the World card here. So it looks like somebody's completing something that they invested a lot of time in. They worked towards something and they got it. It took a long time, but that's okay. We have the King of Swords energy here. Air sign energy could be something about an education could be something about mastering something learning something we have the four of cups energy here okay let me get something with this we have the ace of cups energy it looks like there's some type of relationship that could come out of nowhere it's like don't be don't be like blindsided or don't be disconnected or don't miss something there's something you shouldn't miss because the four of cups is here and then the ace of cups comes out. So it's something that spirit does not want you to miss that you earned it. We have the chariot energy here. Cancer energy is something here about moving forward. You might be moving. You might be changing direction here. You might be traveling. But this is definitely about progressing towards your future. And it looks like it's a very important connection that's going to come into your life. This person could be a Capricorn or a Cancer, which happens to be opposite signs here. We have the Nine of Wands energy here. It's also giving the energy of like having the strength or like being ready for this. Something about being ready for battle, being ready. Let me get something here with this. We have the Four of Wands energy here. Let me get something with the Four of Wands. Somebody's definitely earned this. They've taken a long time to earn this. And we have Judgment answering the call. This is a very positive thing. A very positive thing. Somebody's earned some type of support. It's like earning your spot, earning your place. Okay, like investing. Somebody has to invest some time. It could even be like investing some time into like another company or like, you know, like when a doctor has to do the intern and then they get their practice. But it's like it's a very important relationship that I think is something here about the relationship is going to change your trajectory. It's not just you. It's about connecting. You could meet somebody that changes your whole life is what I'm telling somebody. OK, yes, we do a lot on our own, but there's a reason like you have a piece and I have a piece. You know, it's an ocean, but it's little drops of water make up that whole ocean. And what I'm trying to tell you is that this person, you being connected to this person is going to give you access to a lake or an ocean that you did not have access to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. And then the chariot. Oh, yes, you about to be surfing. Let me get something here with this king of swords. We have the king of pentacles here. I'm telling you, it feels like it's about some money here. It's about a job, a career, uh, being the boss of something, perhaps. Maybe not the boss, but it's something here where you have to invest. You have to invest and you have to earn it. It's like not in a negative way, but it even feels like earning your freedom. OK, not like somebody's in slavery, but it feels like earning your freedom, earning your. Like whatever it is you want to do, we have the moon card here. OK, Pisces energy here. So what is this hidden depth is something here. That's hidden. Why does the devil card have to come out in this reading, y'all? Why? After the moon? Right after the moon? 
Let me get something here. This is about to wear me out. Let me get something here with this so I can see what's going on in the second line. I thought we was doing something. Then we got the lover's card here. Oh no, let me get something here. Oh hell no, oh hell no. We got the 10 of sword here. This is like, I'm first, the first thing I'm gonna say is this is unfair, okay? That's the first thing I'm gonna say because I feel like somebody earned this, somebody invested their time and energy, they paid their debts, they paid their dues, okay? And I feel like whatever this connection is, because I was talking a lot of shit about connections, right? Okay, whatever this connection is, it's something that, nah, nah, that's not, that's not what you're there for. Somebody might have to leave this behind. Somebody like, I mean, everybody's different and stuff like that, but I'm telling somebody what they need to know. This is something you might have to leave behind because I don't feel like this is fair. I feel like you worked for something, but they want something from you. That you that's that old world shit right there. Nah, we're not doing that shit no more. We're not doing that shit no more. Okay, them days is over. Them days is crumbling. Okay, we have the Hermit card here. Somebody here might be on their own or doing something on their own. Or they might have already been doing it on their own. It's just like, I'm not feeling certain energies here. I'm not feeling the Moon card with the Devil and the Lovers. I'm not feeling that. And any reader, like, what does that sound like to you? That sound like some hidden shit where they're trying to have some type of power and control over you. Okay, and it seems like some type of sexual thing. That's really what it seemed like to me. That's really because the cup is right over the devil. The cup, the ace of cups is right over the devil. That's what's on the devil's mind is connecting with you. Okay, that shit don't even seem right to me. That shit turned my stomach when I seen it because I'm just like, whoa, why would you deserve? I mean, you deserve whatever it is you worked for. Confirmation. They about to make me go off. Let me get something here with this judgment. Ultimatum. I know I didn't just hear the word ultimatum. Yes, I did. Thank you, spirit. Y'all, I'm getting scared. <laughs> I am having a conversation right now with spirit right now. Okay? For real. Okay. I got chills right now. I cannot even believe this. They trying to block you from your future? Okay. Let me get something with this. We have the Eight of Pentacles here. Nah, that's okay. Look how that seven, look, thank you, confirmation. Look how that Seven of Pentacles went to the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, cause somebody is skilled on their own. This is fucked up. But as you know what, it's okay because it's not even a waste of time. It's not a waste of time. You were sent up in there, it's a mission. You were sent up in there, okay? For them to probably try you and look stupid as hell. And you still going to be all right. It's okay. You got to trust in God. Thank you, spirit. We have the five of swords energy here. Five of swords energy. Here comes the problem. Let me get something here. Mm -hmm. It's like somebody watching you work or they watching you or they're going to be watching you succeed into that eight of pentacles without their bullshit. And then to the nine of pentacles without that bullshit. Okay, let me get something here. Nah, you're going to do this shit regardless. This is real crooked. We have the death card here with the devil. Exactly. That shit's going to be over. It's going to be done. That shit is crazy. That shit. Oh, I could take your career to the next level if you just know you could fuck off. Okay. We have from the eight of pentacles to the nine, but it was in between the five of sword. Nah, nah, you don't need to do shit to get to the nine of pentacles. You don't have to do no shit like that. Death card is right. This shit this is the end of the cycle right there. We're not doing that shit no more. Nah, you're good. Let me get something here with this lover's card. We have the full card. Exactly. The whole end. The whole end of the whole partnership, the whole contract, the whole shit is null and void. Okay. Somebody must be crazy. Let me get something here. 
Yeah, I knew it. I knew it because you know what I seen? I seen the eight of wands. I was like, oh, yeah, somebody going to get it. My goodness. This is that kind of energy where they try to like fire you or some shit or they try to pin some shit on you or they try to like it's something here where they're going to try to control the information. I wasn't even trying to look at two cards, but it came out. Eight of Wands and the Seven of Swords here. They're going to try to shoot some type of energy. They're going to take action on some type of lies, some type of manipulation here. This is so fucked up. Why am I seeing this energy like this? This is just come on now. I'm going to just keep these right here because both of these are with this Ten of Swords. Both of those. Because I already knew that's what was coming. I already seen that with the Ten of Swords. Nah, this ain't this ain't a real call. This ain't... See, people be thinking... I'm going to tell you something. They're going to think that you have the ultimatum. They're going to think that, oh, you either going to do it or I'm just going to have to fire you. That's what they think the ultimatum is. No, that's not the ultimatum. You either going to get your shit together or your whole life is going to fucking fall apart. That's what the real ultimatum is. And that's going towards them. They think that they are the test. No, you are the test. You are the fucking test. They don't know that. They don't see that. I seen the seven of cups. They don't know that and they don't see that. They really think that they are the ones that's calling the shots. No, that's not how it goes. We have the two of cups energy here. Yeah, you probably already seen it from jump. You probably already seen what this person wanted. Let me get something here with this eight of cups. We have the ten of cups energy. Yeah. Yeah, right after the two of cups. You already seen it. Mm-hmm. They want to be connected and shit. High Priestess and the Knight of Wands. Yeah, you seen it. You already knew what they wanted. You knew what they wanted. Y'all. These cards be hot. Let me get something here with this Five of Sword. I cannot. We have the Queen of Pentacles energy here. Yeah. Money. Money. If you do this, then this, that, and the third. We have the Page of Cups energy. Nah. Okay. Somebody had real high hopes about this shit. They really wanted to connect. I feel like this is some type of offer here. And you're like, what is this? It even looked like some type of hidden offer. You could even be trying to ignore some shit or you try to ignore some shit. You try to push some shit under a table or just, you know, try to act like you ain't hear some shit. You don't understand. You don't, you know. Let me get something here with this Six of Cups energy. Six of Cups? That's the sun in Scorpio. And you know Scorpio's... Oh, well, shit. I don't know if y'all know. And then the Scorpio is right above that death energy. And then the devil card. And then the, the ace of cups. Yeah, you already know what this person wanted. It feel like somebody want to be with you. But I don't think, you know, people be thinking they want to be with you, but they just be wanting to have sex. They just be wanting, like, pleasure. They don't be wanting nothing. Like, let me get something here. We have the Page of Wands energy here. Yeah, once again, Young Energy. Let me get something here. Nah, you're going to be free of this person. If you signed anything with this person, that shit is not even right. We have the Six of Pentacles. You're going to get what you deserve regardless. You're going to get what you deserve regardless. Let me get something with this Two of Cups. They really going to try it though, but it's okay. We got the Emperor energy here. Let me get something here. Okay. This is a person of authority. This could be you. We have the two of swords here. Wait, what is this? I'm starting to think it's this person. And they got that no. And we have the king of wands energy here. See, they're both fire signs. So I'm like, hmm. The Emperor is the one that's in control. If it's the Emperor and the King of Wands, the Emperor is the one that's in control of something. Something is on the fence. Somebody's like, nah. Let me get something here. We have the Knight of Swords energy here. So it looked like somebody's going to speak their mind or somebody spoke their mind. They said what they said. They were serious. Ten of Wands. They were serious. Or, phew. Oh my goodness. Somebody's not giving all that up. And then we have the three of cups energy here. Nah, somebody's not trying to be on no two of cups type of shit. They trying to be on the three of cups type of shit. Like, you know, celebration, feeling good. You know, soul tribe, you know, friends, community. You know what I'm saying? 
They not trying to be on that intimate shit like that. That's what I'm seeing. I mean, unless you're trying to be on that shit, but I'm not seeing that. I'm seeing somebody not understanding why the hell they're getting blocked. Why the hell this is happening to them. Why this person have fucking motives the whole time. We have the six of sword. Six of swords energy here. I feel like somebody's going to get with their their true connections. Like this is going to lead someone. It's like I feel like there's a lot of things that's going to happen that leads up to this that was like building a bridge the whole time that you may not be aware of. And I feel like that's what's going to be your saving grace. It's something here about connections or building with others or being cool with others. Like <sighs> This person's not going to get away with this shit. I'm telling you, it's it's death right underneath the devil car. They're not going to get away with this shit. Whatever they're trying to do or they got their eye on you type shit, they're not going to get away with that shit. They're not going to get away with it. And that shit is not okay. That shit needs to stop across the board, across the world. Okay? It needs to stop. Let me get something here. We have the King of Cups energy here. Yeah, I definitely feel like this, the King of Cups and the Emperor, I feel like this is the collective's energy here. I feel like this is the collective's energy. I feel like you have control in this situation. You can say yes or no. It doesn't matter what this person does after that. The fact that they even put you in a situation, they're wrong, okay? And the fact they're gonna try to manipulate and try to cancel somebody like that, they're wrong. But it doesn't mean that you're not, you're still not in, con look, you're in control of the fucking situation. Like I said, they think that they are the ones that's calling the shot, but when they do that shit to you, they're going to sign and seal and deliver that shit. Okay. That's just going to close out for their ass. And you got the 10 of Pentacles right here. You don't need to do that shit. You don't need to do nothing. <sighs> that's the crazy thing about it. And then you got the seven of cups here. And it's with the king of wands. He's this king of wands got their mind on sex. It's the wands. Like usually I don't zone in on the sexual side of the king of wands, but I'm really seeing it. It's somebody that's like obsessed. Like they must find you like extremely attractive. You know, they must find your energy just like, how can I say this? And don't act like it don't happen to men too. Like, I'm just saying, don't act like it don't happen to men and women be trying to do this shit too. That shit's not right either. To try to cancel somebody because they not trying to fuck. I'm trying to be real. Like, everybody not ready for the conversation, huh? Everybody don't be in that kind of situation, huh? Yeah, that's, that's some nasty shit. To ruin somebody's life because they don't want to fuck you or suck on you. It happens to men and women. Let me get something here. Straight and gay. Okay? It don't even matter. Let me get something here with this Knight of Wands. Yeah, they're very delusional here. They got the Seven of Cups on top of them. They're very delusional. Extremely delusional here. We got the Magician here. Okay, let me get something here. They think that their words is going to change some shit because they always get their way. And it's a lot of people that have been through it. They never going to say anything. I'm sorry for them. I am. But it's a lot of people that have been through it. They will never open their mouth. They will never say a damn word. It's so it's more people that don't say nothing. It's more people that don't say nothing. And they gave up more than they received. I don't give a fuck what that person gave you. What kind of money, what kind of fame. It does not even fucking matter. Because after the whole situation, anybody would know that it's not worth it. That's what they always say. Nobody going to sit there and say that the shit was worth it. Let me get something here. Nah, that shit gonna fucking stop. We have the Ace of Swords here. That shit's gonna stop. Let me get something here with this Three of Cups. Magician and the Ace of Swords. And the Ace of Swords is right underneath the Ten of Wands. It's like there is life and death in the tongue and somebody trying to use the death side of it. They trying to cancel your ass. They trying to kill you with it. They trying to destroy you. Nah. Nah. They trying to control you with their words. We have the three of swords energy here. Something about 33. Okay. Somebody here going to be wounded. I don't know who it is. Somebody going to have to face the truth here and walk away. We got the eight of cups here. And then the four of pentacles. Somebody going to be good. Somebody going to have that stability. Nah, you going to be on top. And I'm not even trying to be funny with that shit. Because that shit's not even funny. Let me get something here. 
It says composure. Yeah, you're going to be all right. It says inner child healing. <sighs> I know that this person don't add nothing good to your damn healing. They try to damage the shit. I'm trying to tell you. Let me get some, just one more. Let me get one more card out here. Composure and inner child healing. It says gratitude. Wow. And it says release. It's something here that must be faced before a cycle can truly close. And it's unfortunate that this shit is still happening to people. But really, it's the people that have the power to take these people down and stop this shit. We go through the same cycle so that we can stop the shit in this life. A lot of things are a lot quicker. There's a lot more that, how can I say, we got cameras and shit everywhere. You can't get away with the same shit. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot going on. This shit is going to stop. Gratitude and release. They're going to release you. Number 35, number 42. I'm going to leave this one right here. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective. I love you guys, and I'll be back with another reading later. Bye.